Parkinson's is a degenerative disease that causes tremors, muscle rigidity, and restricted mobility. There's no cure, but the search is on for new drugs that can halt the disease in its tracks. Ursula Perry reports bioengineers in Central Florida are the first in the U.S. to use a new cutting-edge technique that may pave the way for very early-stage treatments. One million Americans are living with Parkinson's, and for many, current medications don't always control the side effects and tremors. Well, they've affected me since I was in my 30s. Sometimes you get so overwhelmed as far as being tired, uh, you just can't go anymore. Researchers at the University of Central Florida are using a new technology to develop a screening tool, a gene editing system called CRISPR. It allows them to light up a protein in the brain associated with Parkinson's. In this study, we've been working with a protein that was actually isolated from nature. It's very similar to the, something you can find in a firefly when fireflies light up. In this case, scientists use deep sea shrimp, which also have the same ability to glow in the dark. Using the CRISPR system, scientists insert the deep sea shrimp gene into human cells inside a lab. Then they can more easily measure the changes in the Parkinson's protein. The expression of this protein, it goes up in case of Parkinson's disease, which leads to the subsequent, you know, degenerative process. Using the engineered cells, scientists can also screen new drugs to see if they lower the protein level in patients. This is the first step in allowing us to identify potential treatments for this disease. Ursula Perry, KSAT 12 News. The CRISPR system allows researchers to change the DNA of plants and animals without killing cells and with faster results.